The footnote inserted into the legislation at Spain's behest is in Julie Gerling's view inaccurate, deliberately insulting and provocative. In her speech, the Gibraltar MEP accused the European Parliament of colluding at the highest level to replace a legitimately agreed text. We, we failed, which was a shame, but we got 250 to 389, I think, which was a pretty good showing. And uh, unfortunately, the Spanish had made it... They did everything at the last minute to prevent us having a campaign against it. Uh, and that tactic was quite successful because I think if I'd had a chance, I could have persuaded people. We were denied a debate on it. So we requested a debate yesterday. We were denied a debate. So it, given that the odds were so heavily stacked against us, I think we did quite well. And also I had the opportunity to make my point to the whole parliament. And that, at least I got that opportunity to do that. Julie Gerling explained, however, that she later voted for the legislation as to do otherwise would be more damaging for her constituents. I actually voted for the report in the end because I think it would be irresponsible not to. After all, having those British citizens in Gibraltar will want the, will want the, hundred, the 90 days visa-free travel. So it would be silly to cut off your nose to spite your face. We fought the fought, fight against the silly wording. We will continue to fight against silly wording. Uh, the people of Gibraltar can be absolutely clear that we'll support them on that. But we're not going to cut off our nose to spite them. They need that access in and out of Spain and ongoing. And I, I voted in the end that they should have the visa travel. The Gibraltar MEP said the UK is weakened by leaving the EU and that supporters of Brexit are directly responsible for this.